hello friends welcome to my channel today is the 47th day of my venami shrimp culture in uh, bioflog system in the open bioflog system so you can see till now we have not uh, put any aeration on the spiders okay the diffusers we have already taken out last time okay so till 47 days we have not turned on our uh, aeration system and this project is completely running without aeration system and uh, on an average the do is getting maintained to uh, 10 to uh, 12 ppm uh, the day and night time so today is the 47 day uh, of this uh, venom shrimp culture in bioflux system and in this video i'm going to share uh, the details about the culture that is the shrimp growth and the growth uh, sorry the dissolved oxygen in my culture tank without having without running the aeration system let's uh, first check it out uh, the do first what is the do at the moment uh, it's getting maintained at the daytime so <coughs> now it's uh, uh, 2 pm sorry 2 30 pm 2 30 pm okay so so this is the neutron do meter we are using here and uh, i'll show you how much do is getting maintained at the daytime so normally <coughs> in, uh, in daytime last time uh, in 40 days uh, i uh, i showed you that the doe was getting maintained around uh, 12 ppm okay in the daytime and night time it was around 13 ppm so uh, today is the 47th day and uh, let's see how much dew is getting maintained at the daytime so now it's around 2 30 pm so and you can see the dew is showing around 19.7 and this device takes little time so around two to three minutes time it takes to stable okay let's wait till the time and guys if you have any questions or any queries related to this topic you can ask me uh, in the comment section i'll try to respond to your queries as early as possible so <coughs> in uh, in winter normally the feed consumption and the grow is uh, very uh, less because the required water uh, temperature uh, is not getting maintained in the winter time so in my area in daytime the temperature is getting maintained around uh, 22 24 degree within that range and in night time is falls down below 20 degree that it varies from 15 degree to summer 18 degree okay so but the optimum uh, temperature required is more than 20 degree okay but uh, due to um, this uh, temperature factor the the venom shrimps they don't take much feed that's why the growth is getting impacted okay so today is the 47th day of my culture and so far we have whatever we observed that uh, the shrimps are doing really well so the as for our experience the growth is uh, uh, is not that bad okay so you can see it's almost more than one minute i can see the do is showing around 16 and okay so it's almost and slowly slowly it's getting it's dropping okay so you can consider the do is getting maintained around uh, 15 to 16 degree range sorry uh, ppm range okay so last time it was showing uh, somewhere around uh, 12 to 13 now it's showing around 15 15 to 16 range or you can see somewhere 14 to 16 range within that range okay so this was the do information dissolved oxygen uh, in my uh, open bioflow uh, pond without running the aeration system and now let me show you the shrimp growth after 47th day of the culture so let's let me take out the check tray and i'll show you the growth of my venom shrimps after 47th day of the culture <coughs> So you can see this is my check tree and there are so many shrimps are there. Okay. So let me catch one and uh, you can see 
so this is the growth after 47th day of the culture the growth is uh, not that bad okay normally in winter the growth was very stunted growth the growth is very slow but uh, looking at the stems they are very active the guts are filled okay so the stems are very active there is no spots or no or uh, any markings on their body they are very active okay so so far we have not experienced any issues or any major challenges in this culture even though the aeration uh, is not we are not on on the aeration okay so far no issues we have encountered in this culture so this is just 47th day of the culture and another 4250 days uh, uh, in another 4250 days we are going to harvest it so we are very much hopeful without uh, running the aeration probably we are expecting we can do the harvest okay let's see how it goes guys this was all about my uh, 47 day uh, culture of my venom shrimps in bioflux system so if you have any questions or any queries you can put it on the comment section i'll try to respond to your queries as early as possible guys bye bye uh, take care and have a good day soon i'll come with some new informational videos till then bye bye take care and have a good, great day thank you so much